Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Scott's Adventures and the October Video Games Monthly Unboxing. I am hoping to continue the great winning streak uh, that I've been on. Uh, most of the boxes I have received have been fantastic up until this point and, the, and the, the one or two that were not as fantastic were still solid boxes. So uh, let's see what surprises await us for this month's unboxing. Before we get to the unboxing, you know, this is my favorite time of the year. As you can see, I'm wearing a hoodie, uh, no more t-shirt, um, you know, but October is my favorite time of the, of the year. Um, just the cooler weather, um, you know, obviously Halloween coming up, and before you know it, it's Thanksgiving and the holidays. Uh, so it really is an awesome time of the year. Uh, we'll be doing one more video in my outdoor studio, if you will, or as some of the viewers like to refer to it, the camp uh, setting. Um, no, this is not a summer camp. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, probably just one more month. Next month we'll be outside. Uh, and then we'll be moving... Uh, production indoors for the next few months. Uh, obviously, it'll be too cold in Long Island to record outside. Uh, but without further ado, let's get to the unboxing. So, as always, three games. Hopefully, maybe four if there's a one-up. So, I feel the, uh, the postcard. It is not a one-up. No big deal. It's a standard postcard, okay? This, this feels like the free gift. Oh, that's cool. The Pokemon cards. That's actually, oh, and of course I dropped it. That's pretty cool. Uh, it's Pokemon Trick or Trade. So obviously with the Halloween theme, um, Trick or Trade. That is really cool. Um, I'm going to open this up. Let's see what cards I got. Let's see. Again, I again I, I know very little to anything about Pokemon cards. Um, Mimikyu. Mimikyu. Uh, Lampent and Murkrow. So, I doubt they're worth anything, um, um, but uh, in interesting. So, hey, that's you know, it's something different. They sent Pokemon cards this month. I, I really like the idea. So, I'll keep them in this, uh, you know, in the in the foil here. Um, all right, let's see what games I got. Let's see. Maybe there's a Pokemon game. That'd be interesting. All right, so top game is GameCube. Top game is GameCube. And then we definitely have, oh, wow, we have an NES. Haven't had one in a while. There's an NES in here. And then underneath that, there's another NES. That's really cool. So I have a GameCube and two NES games. We're going to pull out the GameCube game first. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. We've been getting a lot of Harry Potter games lately. And I love it when they're complete. And this is complete, I believe. It should be. No, I jinxed myself. There's no manual. I jinxed myself. <laughs> this is, I, think, I think this is the first complete game they have sent me without the manual. But you know what? I'm still happy. I mean, yeah, it doesn't have the manual, but... Um, it's in the case. It's in the case, and, and I'm happy about that. Um, let's check the disc condition, and as usual, nearly or completely flawless. 
very happy with that. That's that's cool. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Now, the NES games. I'm really excited about this. Which NES games did I receive? I'm just double checking. Yeah, they're definitely NES games. Star Soldier. Star Soldier. Label condition is pretty good. Little bit in the corner there. Not a big deal. Star Soldier. That's cool. Very nice. All right. Last one. Mac Max? Am I pronouncing that right? Mac Max? Mac Max. Forgive me if I'm mispronouncing that. I think it's M-A-C. Mac Max. Um, if I'm wrong, I apologize. But again, label is in pretty good condition. Solid condition. Very little up here. This, this is awesome here. Great condition. Um, okay. And you know what? I'll, I'll tell you. I've heard of Star Soldier. I've never heard of Mac Max. I'm not familiar with this game. Um, but that's two great, actually three great additions, including the Harry Potter game. Three great additions to the collection. So, as always, value-wise, how did we do? So, I just added up the value, and I decided to include the Pokemon cards. I actually have value for the, Poke uh, value for the Pokemon cards, according to the price charting app. This is my best box ever. I am blown away. I, I am in shock. So I'm going to save the best for last. For those that have been watching the video, you probably already know which one it is. But we'll save the best for last. First of all, I want to apologize. It's MagMax. MagMax. Not MacMax. Um, for some reason, that looked like a C to me. And again, I'm not familiar with the title. So... That's my fault. It's MagMax. Uh, and while we're talking about MagMax, the value. So MagMax, uh, $6.98. Okay. Star Soldier, $9. $9. The Pokemon cards. This is actually a... The, the Trick or Treat pack here is from 2022. There's also a 2023 Trick or Treat, and I'm sure there's one for this year as well. But this is from 2022. The Murkrow card is $1.48. The Lampent is $1.25. And the Mimikyu, uh, Mimikyu uh, is $1.12. Um, so they all have value. I mean, not a lot, but still, hey, for something that's free... There's, there's about $4 in value. So I'm, I'm including it towards the box. Now, this one was a shock. Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. This is actually a rare GameCube title, as I just discovered. Um... The game with the case, there's no manual. Now, before I tell you the value, when you break down the box at $34.99, each game is $11.66. So just keep that in mind. Each game is $11.66. The value of this game per the price charting app is $62.50. Un real. I had no idea that this Harry Potter uh, version was worth that much money. In fact, I might go on the hunt for the instruction manual just to make this complete. It, it, would, be, it would be worth it. Obviously, it would increase the value, but the extra investment would be worth it um, compared to how little I paid for it. I'm unreal. Video Games Monthly, thank you. That is just 
incredible. Incredible addition to the collection. Huge, huge win. Thank you. And for anyone watching this video that maybe is not a subscriber to Video Games Monthly, if this doesn't convince you, I don't know what will. That this is unreal. So just a huge surprise there. So now factoring in the three games, the three Pokemon cards, total value for this box is $82.33. Even if I factored in the shipping, I'm still up. That's ridiculous. That is crazy. Unreal. $82.33. So great, great month. Uh, great unboxing. Again, Video Games Monthly, thank you very much. Um, and that does it for this unboxing video. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please hit that thumbs up button. Um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already as we continue to grow this channel. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for your support. Appreciate it very much. I'll see you at the next video. Take care, everybody.